Professor HT Theater, today I'm going to talk to you about choosing the correct projector screen. Mostly from the home theater viewpoint or vantage point, I should say. First, I'm going to talk about uh, aspect ratios. What's an aspect ratio? It's basically the, the width by the height. You've got your 16 by 9 aspect ratio, which is very common. It's most HD TV. Uh, TV sets are in and then you've got the new aspect ratio that a lot of people are using the 2.35 to 1 my one got a little bit long I'm gonna take that off that's a one and I did some examples here I took eight inches on my tape measure and I went eight inches and then I went four and a half inches 16 by 9 divided by 2 is actually 8 divided by 4.5 and if you multiply that out a 92 inch screen would be 80 by 45 so you're what you're looking at is basically almost 2 to 1 HD screen size. Now many DVDs uh, come in actually two different formats, the 16 by 9 and the 2.35 to 1 format, which is called anamorphic DVD. So a lot of home theater, dedicated home theaters are now opting to put in the 2.35 to 1 aspect ratio. If you do that on the board, you've got a 4, I've um, kept the constant height of 4.5 and as you see it's 110.57 uh, so that's almost like uh, almost three to one uh, two and a half to one the width to the to the uh, height so you're getting a wider picture in your theater so it envelops you more that's why a lot of the movies are shot and done in 2.35 to one there are some at 2.4 to one but using your zoom lens you could basically use a 2.35 to 1 in uh, using that aspect ratio. So many of the projectors like uh, JVC, Epson, Panasonic, Runco, all the projector manufacturers are using a presets on the remote so you can switch between 2.35 to 1 and 16 by 9. So now if you bought a 2.35 to 1 screen and you switch to 16 by 9, you basically uh, make the width a little bit less. So there's your 16 by 9 on your 2.35 to 1 screen. So it's a little less width. But when you go to 2.35 to 1, these bars, the black areas on the sides go away and it fills the picture. So you have a constant height on the screen. So we're recommending many home theater, uh, dedicated home theaters, to go with the uh, 2.35 to 1. Now, if you're doing a media room and you want to watch 50% maybe the HD TV like football and hockey and some of the sports, you could probably just go with the 16 by 9 format. It makes it a little easier, and that's the way we would go. So that's a Professor HT Theater talking to you about home theater aspect ratios. Now, 